interesting. Yeah, actually, a very good card, too. Yeah, it's a very good card. Anyways, let's go back to our match. Looks like we're going to be on the draw. Okay. But here we are for match three. We're going to try to win uh, our, what, potentially <laughs> our last name. Modern Masters. <laughs> you, me, and Iowa? <laughs> <laughs> I've driven through Iowa. There's no way you, me, and Iowa is a uh, uh, good scene. Uh, we are on the... I, I think it's a keep. I think it's a keep, and I don't like it at all. Yeah, but what are you going to do? Yeah. You complain. I've seen... Uh, I mean, the Flavor House Plague Rasalka is actually pretty nice. Yes. Look at this. Fire Recall. Into Fire Recall. Sure. Uh, let's do... I think we leave with the husk. Leave the husk, yeah. yeah. That's what I was going to say. What are you going to do? 20 turn clock. Yeah! This guy... <laughs> I, I love that we're going to just completely misinform this guy what our deck is all about. Yep. I bet you he goes nest. I bet you he's got... Oh, in the mirror. Oh, no, he's ramping. He's yeah. probably five color. Yeah. Okay, so now let's do this. This. Get in there. All right, we need to draw gas. Yeah, we do. Wow. All right, so he's ramping to a man five five Manta next turn. <laughs> Fiery Fall gets that eventually. Yeah, it does. Okay, that needs to stop. Uh, all right, so let's attack. I think we just bobble rot farm. Yeah. Doesn't matter what we get at this time, I don't think. Nope. Ooh, what's this? Okay. okay. <laughs> that's a fine. That's yeah. fine for us, I think. Did it post combat too? And he doesn't. He that means he doesn't have a. Uh, I guess we could. We have. Sure. Three black. Yeah. Let's get it. Um, he doesn't have a uh, Savage Twister. He can still cast Liege. Okay. Yeah, so pretty slow start here. Two, three, four. For both four. of us. And unfortunately. Wrecking Wow, ball. okay. That's uh, that's I, I mean that's not that people love people fall in love with that play yep. and I don't know I think if we had a different hand that could have been a good play but like I don't think that hurt us no very much at all people fall in love with the land destruction mm -hmm. and uh, I just think he would have been better off saving it for a creature yep yep. It happened to us last week too. Um, well, that guy—he that was actually I think a pretty good play because it he got us. Who's the five? The Manta. Aether Aether swim. swim. Bounce the germ. Okay. Okay. We'll just replay here. Mm-hmm. Oh, he got my turn. Damn it. Well, that's game. <laughs> yeah. So Karn's like the best card ever. That sucks. Target player yeah. exiles a card. Okay. So let's exile the mountain. Damn it. Time, well, we can... I think we sign ourselves. So I think we sign ourselves. Well, let's. I think we got to try to get this Aether Sign off the board so we can at least try mm -hmm. to damage this. Maybe he's got two lands in hand. We'll play it. We'll play it out. Yep. 
So if that's the case, then I think what we need to do is attack Karn with Bloodthorn Vampire. Mm. If he blocks, we'll Grim Affliction. Okay. Sack the token, so then this is a 2-2, two, yeah. two, this is a 3-3. Three, three. Yeah. Gets this off the board. Then we still have Man of Versailles on board. Yep, sounds good. So I think we'll do that second main phase. So, okay. Attack Karn Liberated. Just fell for the trap. Mm -hmm. Now watch as we definitely. I guess we want to actually two throw on ourselves here. Let's say done. We should still have this. Okay. I said okay, right? Please go. All right, there it goes. Then we'll swamp. Sign and blood ourselves. <laughs> Try to. <laughs> All right. Wow. All right. Got us. Sure. He just wants to restart the game because please do. It's fun to do. Yeah, I think be... restarting the game favors us at this yeah. point. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> We'd start with two lands. He would start with two lands. I'm not saying, yeah. I, but I mean, we're in pretty rough shape here. <laughs> the good news is, if he doesn't have Karn, I think we're in pretty, like... Hold on. Let's cancel. What? So we can't fire a ball here, and uh, I guess, what's the play? Uh, equip, play Lodestone, attack Karn. Sure, yeah. And then we're just going to have to <laughs> fire a ball. Yeah. No, he may exile at that point. Yeah. Probably want to leave him with the option to restart the game because him making a mistake and restarting the game is probably our best out at this point. That's right. <laughs> so we need to attack on. Again, not a lot yeah. of chances here, but we'll play it out. Yep. <laughs> he could do something pretty dumb. What? He could do something pretty dumb. Yeah. On this one. Bye bye, Fiery Fall. Yep. Awesome. Oh, I should have, uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter. Could have made our vampire a 4-4. Four, four. Yeah. He's... Well, he doesn't have any cards in his hand. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, he has a card on the table. What do we care? I mean, now we can't exile our... our uh... Should we attack him? No. <laughs> what can we do? We can't do anything to Karn anyways. Sure. Let's attack him. Okay. Maybe... Honestly, we might just want to scoop here and preserve our clock. I understand. We're at 20 minutes. We'll, we'll okay. play it out a couple more turns. See what okay. Maybe we'll restart the game. Yeah. Exile my forest. Ridiculous. Yeah. See, like, we could draw Dread Drone and almost have a clock on him. It's true. Right? Yeah. I, I think maybe we do want to keep attacking Karn, though, just so we can't to start exiling permanence out of the game. But, I mean... I don't know. He can... He can... I don't want to waste time talking about it. <laughs> That's for sure. That is definitely the incorrect play, is to spend any amount of mental energy. <laughs> maybe we should have bone splinters there no well 
This guy took your car, man. He did. I'm, <laughs> I'm just so mad because you, no joke, I have done, I have no idea how many Modern Masters and haven't opened a card. You've done a lot. So. Yeah. I was telling Ryan before we started streaming, I did one earlier and every, it was a Phantom Draft, of course, and every rare that I opened was a Cryptic Command. Triple which is just cryptic. It is. Don't, let's not even show them. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Got us, man. Yeah, he got us. Karn got us. I don't think... I mean, not that anyone had... There's an, there's nothing you can really bring in against Karn here, so... No. Uh, he's five color. Which means this is a questionable... It's okay. Yeah, but I think we want the Venture Rebirth in, because right. that can go straight to yeah. the Karn. Straight to the Karn. I like it. It's good. It's good saying. Bring on some Carnage. <laughs> Double. <laughs> A doubler. I'm on fire! <laughs> uh, he has either snipe. I don't mind the Deus against him. No, I don't mind it either. Because uh, the question is, is, is like could we go... Is Flames for three good? Is it better than like Grim Affliction or a Fiery Fall? I guess the only consideration was, do we have a super aggro deck here? No, like, we don't. Could, could we build one? Like, oh, what is the most aggro deck we build? We could do this. Black, red. This. I'd be... But, like, you know, like, cut out the... Cut out the Sign of Blood, cut out the Calling Dias, and get some red in here. Go Blood Ogre. I think this is a worse deck, but I don't think we can really afford to keep Tribal this game Flames going long. This probably be the aggro list we could get. Aggro... What about... Aggro list? Yeah. Bellows, if we're, if we're going... All it does is get a... I mean, it's six. It doesn't do anything. It just gets a creature out of the way. Yeah, but if he's creature light, which he appeared to be, it could also do six damage. Well, if we we're going to do that, I'd try to do, like, controlling them. Okay. You know? Like, yeah. this is not an aggro card, is what I'm saying. I guess it could be better. But even, I would... Like, the Grim Affliction can hit these bats if we have the right draw. Yeah. Bats, I think, are, are important. Uh, all right. So if we want to go super aggro, what do we cut here, then? Uh, the Vengeful Rebirth, Rebirth, the Bauble. And Fiery Fall? Yeah. Th this is if we want to do this. And I think we... I'm a, Actually, I think we I think we might have to. We're going to have to go okay. under him, yep. do some damage, yep. and then try to go over the top, yep. either by having Liege or yeah. Bitter Blossom or something in play. Uh, we can probably cut is this. Is Rasulka any good against him? Turns on bats. Sure, okay. Okay. Yes. Skeleton here is kind of bad. I think we'll keep this because this is a potential, like, between Rod Farm and this, like, having this sure. guy get plus one, plus one is potentially yeah, good. Yeah, do we want to add in another Axa oh, Swamp yeah. and add in the Mountain or two? I think, this is a, I think this is a worse deck, but I think it's what we have to do. So that's one, two, three, four red sources. We probably need to do one more. Yeah. Uh -oh. We do have double bobble, but... Oh, shoot. Right. Yeah, we're a weird deck. I wish we would have had um that discard, Waking Nightmare. This can this could be okay. Yeah, discard would be good against him, man. Yeah, normally, five, he mulled the five. normally you can pick up as many of those as you want, and that was probably wrong to play mine, but that's alright. I actually don't think it can matter unless we draw a sign blade, I suppose. We took it out. Okay, well then. And I actually think we play imp first because he mulled the five. Yep. Yeah, I think so too. We'd rather have a two two bat if we can try to get it. And look, yeah, crack, we'll crack the bobble. And thinner deck by one. Sure. Manta is really bad for us, but we didn't see any in the first game. So let's hope. We'll get our forest. Yep. Mm -hmm. Come on, deck. <sighs> oh, we didn't want to play a land? I did. I thought I saw the lands highlighted. Oh, no, oh, we no, couldn't write. No, no, I screwed it up. Yeah, because we had a we ramped one. Yep. Oh, good news is it didn't punish us yet. So 
This guy was in first. Just in case he counters it. Three Manta? Please don't Savage Manta. Twister. Do it. No. <laughs> Wreck us. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, that's fine. Yeah. That's actually great, because we can block that forever. So he's running into some <laughs> of the same issues we had, trying to run yep. Wolfbriar Elemental yep. in a five-color deck. You just don't end up with enough green to make yep. it better than a 4-4, four four, which is okay, mm -hmm. but there's no real big payoff. In our deck again, I guess. Yep. Can't keep drawing lands forever. We can, actually. Well, yeah. ten more turns. Let's not do it, though. It doesn't, I'm not looking it doesn't seem optimal. Three turn clock, though. Yeah, if he has no flyers, if he has Karn, he'll exile. He would exile. Karn's not great for us. <laughs> is Karn ever good? That is. <laughs> is Karn ever that, a good? That thing? is a valid statement. <laughs> I was like, well, maybe we could. I'm like, he could exile one and we'll kill it, but it's like, no, 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 we're not. Yeah, we're no, we're not. That <laughs> That'd be a very upsetting if he just slams Karn here. Boom. <laughs> this is our first, I think, really bad mana match, but we'll yeah. see what happens. Maybe he's all land. Yeah. I know. It's a cold shot, Karn. But uh, if he exiles one and then we rip our Creekwood Leech, does that save us? Creekwood Leech. Okay, no Karn. Don't Karn me, bro. Here it comes. Land. Well, he would, I think he'd slam it, right? He'd slam yeah. it down. Yeah. Five. This is an able. Oh, ooh. Ooh. That's not bad. Yeah, but no, but that's... He could still have Karn in hand. He needs a land. Yeah. Bring the beats, bring the funk. So, Karn actually doesn't win. We, we just kill him if he has Karn. No. All right. Unless he has Bolt or Burst Lightning. But. So our sideboarding decision hasn't made a difference yet, but... Do it. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Well, we still need to take down right. one more, but yeah, mold of five. We can hope for another mold of five. That was our worst. That was our worst um, mana game so far. That was so. yeah. It's, it's not like we. All right, so now we're on the draw. Do we go back to like more controlish, or do we still try to go under? I think we have to go under. I think back. so too. Right? I think that we have a good chance of going under though, because he's all he's shown. He's shown us a lot of high stuff, not a whole lot of. So I'm wondering with the monstrosity and the uh, sure Wolfbriar. This could be a good card because he's yeah, a yeah, clutch card. Yeah, first. yeah. So I'm back on this. Okay. And I'm gonna do one more, one more mountain. Sure. Even though this could hurt us with the liege. But. Yeah. But we, I mean, we still do have two bobbles. Like. Yeah. That's true. that's no joke. And I'm comfortable with the rest. All right. All right. Last match. Are All we right. gonna win six packs let's, or are we gonna win two? Let's get six. That's some other funny thing is these packs aren't really worth anything. Yeah, not as much anymore. <laughs> but it's for pride, damn it. For pride, damn it. Well, we can. They, you can still sell them for like four tickets if we wanted to. There it is, the double red. There with it. the creek with lead. With the lead. Oh, Call shot. All right. So we can play husk. If we draw a swamp in our first two. We can play hopefully bat for two. If we draw any land, we can spike evoke spike bellows. These are it's kind of like a mull. Yeah, yeah, I think we're already mulling, so I think we I think we have to mull here. Okay. Better. Sure. Yeah. Lodestone Golem makes Karn an eight drop, and the difference between a seven drop and an eight drop is huge. That's what your mother said. Y your mom can't even feel the difference between a seven <laughs> drop and an eight drop. <laughs> hey oh. I see you turned. You took my joke and you, <laughs> and you turned it around on me. Very good. I'm trying. Now I'm trying to think of a seven drop and an eight drop, and I can't. Hopefully, no kids are watching this. Yeah. I feel bad. Don't kids. Don't listen. Don't, don't be like us. Yeah. Don't. Be, oh, look at this. A two drop. Yeah. Oh, don't be like us, kids. Yeah. Inappropriate. You started it though. It was me. I started. <laughs> it's completely my fault. I take take total blame. 
Sure. All right. Yeah, that's fine. He burst lightning nurse up a river. He yep. did not see it. I'm gonna go sickle slicer. Nope. Or probably kill. Yeah, Blast. tribal flames that guy. Oh, yeah, like the flames or the affliction. Um, I like the flames. Okay. Because the affliction can shrink a dude, and it has other synergies later. Whereas fl that's as good as the flames is gonna get. Probably. All right, so we really want to land here. Yeah. Okay. We can still do this. Yep. And the double bone splinters is not the worst. No. Especially not with a living weapon out That's there. right. If he goes like Etched Monstrosity here or Wolfbriar Elemental, we can just slam it. There it is. So I think we definitely... Well, should we just play Golem and then try to do this next turn? Yeah, I'd like to get the Golem. I'd like to get the Golem too, yeah. And that makes Aether Snipe cost one more, so he couldn't bounce yep. it. Yeah. And then next turn we will plan on Bone Splintering, Sacking Germ, Killing Monstrosity. Potentially after an attack, depending on what he does. Boo! Ooh, that sucks. That makes me think he has Karn. <laughs> I'm just going to put him on Karn, Karn the rest of the game. Well, don't worry. You want It won't be very long. We'll know next turn, right? Yeah. Okay. So we'll attack for two, and I think yep. we have the Bone Splinters, because yep. he's an even one mana away yep. from drawing three cards. And if he has Karn, I just think we are dead. Yeah. No, I, I think that is accurate. But... Do it. Creature, that'd be sweet. No. Yeah. We can scoop. We can equip them. What? We can equip them. Yeah. And we can shoot for three. Maybe this will be the, one of those thirteen damage. We can shoot for three. Wow. Well, if we get one yeah. tap. Yep. Oh my goodness, this would be the greatest. No. Don't no. do it. No. No. What does he got? Six. Repeal. Kicked first lightning. On that. Yeah. Oh, I guess if you got the mana. Smoke them if you got the mana. <laughs> <laughs> we had a zero mana. I guess, what's it called? Is in this mutagenic growth? I, it's fa I guess it's fair to play around it. Yeah. No, don't do it. Nope. No Karn. Wolfbriar? Wolfbriar? Shrewd Hatchling. We can kill that. Yeah. Unless he has a red spell. <laughs> Well, we can still kill that. Ooh, that's actually oh. nice. I think we gotta kill this. I really? don't think we do. Because, he, okay, if he, he has plays... to have your. I mean, he's not on these colors exactly, and this plus this is yeah. pretty fast. And I think that. And this. Yeah, before too long, we'd be able to. So this is yeah. the play, huh? Yep. I, I. Yeah, I think it's not. A, you know. Yeah. Alright. I, I. After reassessing it, I am on board. I, we have to figure out to win the game. Yep. <laughs> we need to win the game. And yep. uh that's our fastest. Playing around things is great, but sometimes <laughs> No, no, no. No Karn. He would slam it. Just slam it. Tap seven. They are already savoring the moment. <laughs> Maybe. He's probably typing to his there it comes. Six, seven. No yeah. that, <sighs> That's why I wanted Karn, because he's so good. He just wins. Whoa, okay. Uh, we'll exile the yeah. splinters. Yeah. Yeah, because now we uh, swing at him for seven. He has to exile a card from our hand. No, it's not seven. Oh, uh, five. Five. Oh. He can still exile the imp. Yeah, okay. He's still not in the door shape. Okay. <laughs> we, if we drew bolt, we'd be okay, I think. Yes, bolt Cold would be good. bolt. Oh, more swamp. I don't think we wanted to play that way, but... Oh, sure. We're attacking Karn. Yep. 
Well, I think he, he's priced into... Well, no, he can just plus one, right? Yeah. I would say he was priced into minus Incarn, but yeah, we should have held the land. Man, this is where having like a bane fire would really be nice. <laughs> yeah. Or how about our own Karn? Because then we could Karn his Karn. Like, I mean, while yeah, we're while we're, we're wishing. Wrecking ball. Oh, yeah. Cool. He's got it all. Needed him to whiff on one or two more lands. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Well, at this point, I'm playing it out, so... Yeah, I mean, yeah, at this point, it doesn't really... It's like... The, the, I was I was a little bit interested in scooping just because of a time consideration. Yep, first, first match, sense, But this but one... Yep. Yeah. Waste as much of our time as you want. And let him go to town. Yeah, it's a shame we didn't have a little bit more aggressive deck to board into. We were kind of like yeah. token control. I still had fun. No, this was a fun deck. It's a. Sh I mean, we ran into Karn. He played Karn twice, and we lost to Karn twice. Yep. Uh, Hold it, I guess. You can make us discard it. No, we can because we'll still get a land in hand. And the, no, the green matters. No, oh, I get it. It doesn't matter at all because the slaughter master. Yeah. Would be. We don't have vengeful rebirth now. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Keep going, man. I guess we're three turns away, and if he draws a red spell, us. Yeah. So. So the funny thing is, like, well, not funny thing, but like, without Karn, I think we're fine. Yeah, he has two burst lightnings, which that's pretty nice. But Karn is definitely what... right. But I mean, look at what he's he's ramping yeah. to: either snipe, etched monstrosity, yep. which we can deal with. Yeah. We have flyers that go over the top. We have tokens that block him forever. Yep. Uh, we just can't deal with Karn. <laughs> yep. Can nobody can? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that do it. That does it. That's that does legal. it. That's a shame. That's not even a good card against us. Yeah, we don't have too much, huh? Well, it's still fun. It was fun. No, Karn, lose like, to Karn felt bad. Lose to, you, but... yeah, draw Karn, lose to Karn. That's yep. basically what it amounts to in this format. So, Yeah, it looks like we were a ways off, too. From yeah, the yeah, we got so. And, but yeah, I think that, so I mean, it's... I wonder when that guy got the Karn. Because um, his deck looks like it's a, it's a pretty... The deck key. was set up to be definitely... Yeah. Take advantage of Karn. Yep. Uh, my guess is you got it pretty early. Uh, Although first we... or second pack and was already sort of. I don't think, like, if that just falls to you. Well, I mean, the thing about it is like it's good in any deck. He could. Well, it's good in any deck. His deck was very good to mm -hmm. take advantage of it. Yep. But the fact is, he was in an archetype that exists, and uh, even if you opened a pack three, it's just like, oh, perfect, yep. the exact card I want. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Well, that was fun. Yeah, it was. Um, so we went uh, two wins in our last draft, two packs, picked up mm -hmm. a Bitter Blossom. I forgot, you know, I, was, we, I know we mentioned the Noble Hierarch, mm -hmm. uh, which is eight tickets, but the, this is like six, two. So we, basically between the packs where we actually made out this yeah. draft did pretty well. Um, had a nice, fun deck to play, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I, we'll look tomorrow and see where we cut out. Uh, I know we cut out at some point in the middle. Uh, so hopefully not too much got ruined. At the very least, it seemed to be in match two, so and you might miss part I can always two. record a voiceover, like a short little video. Yeah, we can we do a little to. one if we need to. Um, yeah. But overall, fun draft. Uh, had a good time. This is probably our last Modern Masters, so we'll probably sell off these two packs and sell off the singles. Uh, maybe. I don't know. We'll see what, what we want to do. Um, and move on to what looks to be Holiday Cube next week, so... Um, next week we may even do a couple drafts next week depending on how fast the games go because uh, Holiday Cube can be that fast depending on yeah. how things go yeah. so we'll set up to do some Holiday Cube next week um, as always uh, feel free to subscribe on YouTube Twitch or follow us on Twitter all um, Charging Badgers on Twitter uh, Charging Badgers on Twitch on YouTube we can't have a name until we have 500 followers and we're pretty far away from that at this point but if you do a search uh, we're, I think, on our Twitter channel as well as on our, twi uh, our Twitter feed and our Twitch channel. I think there's links to the YouTube channel. Feel free to subscribe. If there's anything else you guys want to see, we do lots of limited uh, because it's easiest for Brian and I to do that without preparation. There will be some weeks, you know, next week's holiday cube, but if they had like regular cube or like had a throwback and no other cube, 
um you know if you're looking if you'd like us to see some new other content let us know what you'd like to see and we'll try to squeeze that in in between formats um that could include uh modern standard um we could ask you know if you want to see us like try some brews in those formats rather than established decks we can try that if you want to see more mojo sto which we have a video up uh we can record some more mojo sto um you know we're kind of looking to fill niches that uh other content providers don't fill per right. se so if uh you know you can go to channel fireball and star city and get kind of the latest metagames for standard and modern and and that's not our cup of tea well not cup of tea but it's not our we're not necessarily great at it you're gonna get better advice elsewhere yeah oh yeah so if there's something else you do want to see uh then maybe we can fill that niche let us know